Hello, welcome to more of me playing StarCraft 2. This is going to be commentary time. Let's see if I can do accurate or even decent commentary. Only one way to find out is to actually do it. It's nice. But I just hit a button. Yeah, there we go. I meant to do that. I want to see me type that in again because I completely did not hit. I want, to, I want to look at the production. There we go. It looks more epic this way. This is actually going to be the second time that I have watched it since the first time it did not record properly. I'm dreadfully sorry for that. But everything's doing good now. Yes, building my supply depot at Ted, like I'm supposed to. Alright, building that, building that, and save you. Which is your Hmm, yes, very interesting. What can you really talk about when the first epic moments of the game, other than you're gonna realize something? Yeah. I think it's more entertaining if I do the first person one. Since already, I'm just mostly gonna watch and see every single mistake I am doing. Now I have the ability to be all ghosty. And actually be able to pay attention to anything I want without well, since stuff is actually happening. Go, 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 float, float like the wind. There's some gas coming up. stupid in my scout and I didn't even change the way my SCV is going. I should have went back up here and got it. Oh look, I, I am doing that. Yay! Oh, come on. Go oh, over here. Come on. Move. Over here. Please. Please. Fine, don't do it. Aha! He was, he was taking a vacation. The vacation is over now. And Zergling. I'm guessing he's good enough. For, yeah, he's good enough for that. Then he can quickly stop. See, he has the attention span to be able to do that. I actually do not have the attention. Stop that, so I just see you guys on my phone. Then I think that just gives me some gas for later on. No. Think ahead and be prepared. And it's a player camera. This is the exciting camera. Our forces are under attack. You think that would save you? My Marine will take care of that. <laughs> Supply block. Supply block. I'm actually not sure the ranking of this opponent, but I'm pretty sure he's a lot higher than Brock. Call it a hunt. Zergling, meet Marauder. Marauder, Zergling. Let's see what we all have in the face. There you are, I found you. Alright, Flying Crawler is E though. Ooh, I didn't know they did 30 damage with armor. Aha, uh -huh, I have learned something from this. 
They do really good damage with an armor. Fine, Carlos. You are my bane of my existence. How dare you be blocking. You ain't streaming across in separate directions. It would be more effective with it. Only one way to find out. Who is the more effective person at using their units? Supply block. That's my special attack technique called supply blocking Zerg. If I see a Zerg has some overlords, I want to go shoot the overlords so that they lose supply. We have to use 100 minerals to remake an overload. In a lava. The lava. Yeah. Lava. They must use lava to remake their overload. Marva. There you go, I can say it correctly. Marva. So one less lava. Lava. No, lava. One less amount of lava that they have. Like, I don't want to do STEM! I probably should have, if I would have, um. Maybe. Try to, to, to kill the spine crawl, I might have been able to do, uh. Do a lot of damage here. Never mind. Look at all those airplanes. Defend yourself! Oh, that, that's. That's. Yeah, go force. Okay, and now I know he's up at one base, or he is one base above me. And I have been slacking on my SCVs. Here, allow me to assist myself. SCV, SCV, E, E. Oh. Can I actually get the hotkeys? Not hit the hotkeys. That's right. I'm getting infantry weapon one. He's getting melee zerg attack one. I'm getting two more brothers as well. Bunga. Looking to uh, secure my expansion. Very reasonable thing to do. I'm, I'm told. The expansions are a good thing to have. Also told that defending your expansion is a good thing to have. Oh, we're both. Ah! I have lost my... See, I specifically wanted to fight him here so I can use this to prevent them from getting us around on me. If, if he would have got a surround on me, that would have been over. Could have taken out my entire little army here. But my professional opinion, in the amount of zerglings that he has. If I encounter them here, I take very minimal losses. Come on! Come on! Come on! Something! At least I'm building marines and marauders, right? Right. At least I'm doing something right. I'm forgetting to make my military units. No, I'm not making the, my little worker units to actually back up my military army. Because that's how I roll. I don't have to back up my own units. I don't need to make SCVs if I don't want to make SCVs. I'm gonna, like actually started to make SCVs. Come on, come on! Ah, that's me hitting it. Back. Look at that epic income. Lost my unit. 
He has lost more units and more resources. See, that's how it's supposed to be. 25 behind him, but with his income, it's not good. Ooh, some fire. So I didn't even got to look up over here. Why are there supply depots on this map? I don't feel the supply depots. They're not giving me supply. What are they doing there? Supply depots? Tell me your purpose. Is there a third player I don't know about on this map? That goes on building supply depots? Festa? One of Festa coming up. Let's see what's in the map. It's probably gonna be you. Yeah, it's you. One of Festa coming up. Three mutas. This is not the count you probably want to have or any same person should have. You should not be more than 20 behind. Never be more than 20 harvesters behind your opponent. Never! So me no excuse for it. What am I doing? I'm moving out with a force. A great force. Because I believe I am ready. difference between it GG and never play the game again all you can do why am I not microing correctly I could have if I microed I probably could have killed two more meters at least building eight rings because you need more rings and I'm lazy to say ma Put the marines on there. Yeah. 
Murder them! I'm in the same person. What can I say? That is such a sad, sad looking YouTube account. That is such a sad YouTube account. Oh well. Seems I'm doing something incredibly intelligent right here. I mean, it looks like a lot, but it's not. Goodbye, expansion. You have served me well. You haven't even paid yourself off yet. Don't worry, we got this. We got this! There's a bunker right here, we could go in and be safe. But no, we got this. We're manly marine. Ah, uh, I shouldn't go to the circle to come help you. Sorry! Ah! I am Terran! I say no! I did not kill that. Murderers! Right there. Alright, I have one more thing. Not getting murdered. I killed one egg. Calculate. Stop it, stop it, stop it. Good. I'm smart enough not, not to foolishly attack that. Well. Come on, no coward, attack me. Looks like at least I took out two of his bases. Oh, what's this? What, what, what am I doing up here? That's right. I'm expanding in the last place you would expect. Ha! Aha! Hero! He's a hero! I can't die yet. I wasn't building anything for that entire time. You don't notice that. I noticed it. I noticed it. Don't worry, I have three tanks. I'm well prepared for anything. But there's not C. The pro thing to do. I really don't know why I didn't do this right here. Don't worry, this Mar is coming from nowhere to help. It's like I can save the day. I can do it. So I have one kill. Take that. One ling. I have one Marauder, one tank, and four Marines. I got this. He has no units. Damn. Seems like kicking ass. I, there, I finally realized I lost. Damn! These marines are awesome! Look at him! Six kills! Six kills and he still didn't die. No, I think I actually prefer the other way before. This way's fun in, in the fact that I get to view my every single mistake in greater detail. Every mistake. All of them. Together. Well. See you guys next time.